Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to delete your YouTube history. First thing first, let's launch the YouTube app. When you actually launch the YouTube app, it will be thrown through the feed of YouTube. You want to go on your own profile, so you're going to click on the lower right corner where you see the icon says you. You click on it. When you're on your own profile, you want to click on the top right corner where is the gear icon. And then when you're at the settings, you want to click on Manage All History. You click on Manage All History and here you will have the options essentially to look up and to see can you opt in for auto delete, meaning that all the history, if you click over here, you will have the option to auto delete all the activity after this period is passed. For example, in our case, we have default function over here as 36 months this means after three years everything that is older than three years will be automatically deleted if you click on this one then of course you can readjust it to 18 months which is month which is one year and six months and then you can do only three months period if you set this one uh you know the idea over here is that your most recent searches will be deleted if you pick up the year and, and six months this is probably going to be uh, a little bit less relevant to your current uh, search queries so this is the case over here and of course the last option will be the one that uh, will be queries most likely irrelevant at this point of your life because this is three years past also you can scroll down and you can essentially don't auto delete uh, and simply go through manually you can go manually and pick a particular time frame or activity in which you want to delete it this is how you can go about it. In my opinion, guys, it's always better for you to go in manual settings. Also, right before auto delete, you have an option over here. It says saving your YouTube history. You can prevent doing all the heavy lifting and, and, and hard work by simply coming over here. And you can simply turn off. When you turn off, you're simply going to pause YouTube history. What this will simply do, this will limit or disable any personal experiences this simply will mean that youtube will not have the data to recommend you ads to recommend you content channels shorts uh, so it will be pretty random of course there are advantages and disadvantages of this we all know there is a specific target uh, advertisement target algorithm target content generation in which it helps the algorithm to recommend you stuff right also you can manually tick up or down these particular indications because they can collect data for uh, YouTube videos you watch, right? So based on this, they can recommend you more from the channel. They can, you know, generate or collect your searches on YouTube, all the queries that we already mentioned, the ones that are relevant, less relevant, and the ones that are already irrelevant. Uh, again, plenty of options over here. You can simply not allow them to do so, so you don't have to delete anything. Because if they don't keep up with your search queries and your search history or watch history, you probably not have anything to do it. But in my opinion, go on your settings, the steps I show you, and, and you know tweak left and right and see which one works for you. For more tips like this, guys, subscribe and come back for more.